Don't forget to like the video, share, and subscribe to the channel if you like the content. If you're a hater, just click the X at the right of your screen. If you want the access to exclusive content, follow us over there onto Patreon. All of the links to access my content are in the description box below. What is up, you guys? Thank you so much for being a part of my channel. I really and truly appreciate each and every one of you guys. I just wanted to let you guys know what is going on over there on Patreon. I have added new tiers on to my patreon with extended access to me um i have not actually offered these readings before but now um i'm doing one-on-one -on -one phone calls so feel free to either upgrade your subscription or to go ahead and join that third or fourth tier um the fourth tier is where i have the one-on-one -on -one readings um, again, thank you so much for all of your time, energy, love, and support, and I really appreciate you guys. Bye. What is up, you guys? Thank you so much for being a part of my channel. I really and truly appreciate each and every one of you. We're going to go ahead and jump into the next 24, see what it is you guys need to know, what you need to be aware of, and what you can expect. <laughs> Let's go ahead and look at this, y'all. I really feel like I need to be pulling some charms. If I look down after I pull some of these cards and I see my charms just sitting, that we will pull them. But I see a P, a shape. There's a P shape, like the letter P, in my candle wick right now. Like a little curl or whatever. Um, I have not actually lit my candle. I am going to do that as well. But I feel like there's a significance in this. Because I, I, I don't know why I even randomly looked at it. But I see a P. Okay. So you may be dealing with someone with a letter P in their name. Um, or something significant coming from a P. Okay. Um, and when I, we've got that ghost on the bottom, it could be somebody who has crossed over. Somebody here who is trying to uh, connect with you in this time. Their name, I feel like, could have started with a P or they may have had a nickname that they went by. Um, that was a P. They're coming in uh, to give you some kind of news or information. I really feel like it's talking about like um, a spirit trying to access you in this time um, to tell you about something that is coming for you. And it looks like something positive. We've got promotion, fast cash here. Okay, I feel like this could definitely be something that you have overlooked for some time. Or if you were wondering where, you know, things were going to go with your job or with a certain endeavor that you have um, been embarking upon. And maybe you haven't gotten um, clear answers. It's almost like you may have been asking. I see somebody getting really frustrated about something that they're seeing. And then like, they're like, oh, why is this this way? Okay, or why is this? It's almost like you're not talking to anybody, but you're saying it out loud. Okay, um, you have a deceased, I about said loved one, so a deceased loved one, okay, someone who is definitely active on your spiritual team, telling you that it's going to be okay, there's something that's going to be okay, okay, something that may have been frustrating, um, there's something about, you had to look at a situation differently, or how to cross a situation, or cross-examine, so there could be a cross-examination going on in this time, maybe um, it's holding certain things up, or causing certain delays, um, you've got somebody over here telling you just to be patient with what is going on because there's certain things that are having to happen behind the scenes. They got you is what they're saying. They've got you. Okay. And I said P. It was, look, the P disappeared after I said that. Okay. Um, the P. This is my high priestess card as well. So that's very, um, you are on your way to gaining more knowledge. Okay. Um, I feel like for those of you who were thinking about going back to school, okay, there could be a message that's coming back in for you. Yes, you're on the right track. Keep your uh, mind pure in this time. Pure. I'm getting all the P words. Purification, priestess, promotion. Uh, I'm about to say pop a leg, but papa, pop, pop. Okay, um, there, there's something serious going on right now, and they want you to know that you are getting certain signs and synchronicities. You're looking over them, though. I see you getting aggravated because maybe you don't understand what it is that this person is trying to convey to you or the spirit is trying to convey to you, but they are coming through. I also get you may actually be, <laughs> some of you, I guess maybe you're still in this, you know, 
energy of being a little bit nervous when you start having spiritual activity happening around you. Uh, they want you to, they said calm down. There's something about calm down. It's just them, okay? They're just trying to communicate with you. Um, they're not trying to scare you in any kind of way, okay? Um, like I see somebody over here um, doing salt rituals like uh, salting the doors, salting the windows, you know, that's the salting ritual because there may be things that are happening around you that are kind of scaring you. Um, it's not, it's not a, a negative entity is what I want to tell you. It's not a negative entity. This is somebody who has crossed over, who is actually trying to help you along the way, along your path. But it's like, I don't know if you're misreading the guidance that they're trying to give you or what they're trying to say, but they're just saying you're getting very aggravated in this time because you feel like you're not hearing them. You're about to have something happen, okay? Don't freak out, okay? So that's what this is about. They're saying something's about to happen. Don't freak out. Um, they're wanting to reach out to you, but they want you to stay calm. They want you to know that it's not... Um, a negative entity that's trying to come after your ass okay it's not it's not that it is them trying to contact you with certain information that you're overlooking or something that you're not seeing that will actually help you elevate okay i feel like there may be something that's about to be asked of you as well okay because they took me back to like a show that i used to watch it was really hard to get into that show, dude. <laughs> um, magicians. Alright. Uh, it's taking me to the this, this spot in that show where... She's... Communicating with a uh, god or, you know, spiritual presence or a goddess or something. Okay, she's trying to communicate with something. A god. I think it's god. Or a god, it's a goddess the way they show. Anyway, um, and she was on the verge of losing faith, but she's like, somebody says that you're dead. You're not dead. I know you're there. Please, like, asking for a sign of something. So you may have uh, grown a little bit um, wary, uh, waiting on a specific sign from you. Is either this ancestor, this spiritual team, or possibly God? Some of y'all may have been questioning God. Okay. If you have specifically asked for a sign, don't freak out because I feel like this may be the time when you start seeing the signs that you was already asking for. And it's almost like they're going to be, it's going to be, it's, it's, I don't know if this is necessarily miracles, but it's going to be hard to believe. It's going to be things that are coming through that are a little bit hard to believe. Okay. Um, you may think that they are signs of like it's something that you couldn't tell people because they would tell you that you're crazy you know those the people living in the matrix the closed-minded individuals they would tell you you're crazy this is going to be between you and whoever this is that you're asking they're going to show themselves to you okay um i feel like you're about to have your faith re-strengthened Okay, there's something about having your faith re-strengthened in this time. Um, I feel like you may have been asking for certain communication, but then once you once you uh, moved your mind away from that, you stopped thinking about it or you weren't grasping what it is. Like they were actually communicating with you, but you're overlooking it. So there's about to be some kind of spiritual communication that comes in for you in this next little while that may possibly freak you out, but it's going to restore your faith. Okay, there's something that's about to restore your faith. Um, it's going to bridge some kind of gap for you. And it's going to help you get through um, something that I don't feel like you would have been able to get through without spiritual assistance. I'm just going to say. Um, it, it looks like something that may have been a pretty lengthy jump. Um, something that, you know, most people cannot accomplish. I feel like you're about to be given some kind of spiritual assistance to accomplish this. Okay. What is it that their team wants them to know what is this they're trying to communicate yeah you're about to get a wish fulfillment i saw um look from the dead it's messages from the dead coming through like hardcore you are going to see somebody who has crossed over do not panic you they're going to be coming through so clearly i feel like there's going to be like you're going to see um for you for some of you it is ancestors it's like you're going to see this person so clearly um that maybe certain characteristics that they had uh, before passing, you're going to notice those and you're going to know, okay? You're going to know. Um, there's about to be some kind of like a 
they're reaching out to you in this time and they want you to be able to grasp what are they gonna try what are they trying to tell you what are they gonna be trying to tell you what are they gonna be trying to tell you they're giving you some news they're giving you information it's all about communication let's see i'm about to see though i'm gonna you know do my i'm gonna math i'm gonna make the math math in just a second okay so yeah it's a gift they're giving you a gift okay it's the gift of knowledge the gift of some <laughs> The gift of gab some of y'all may have the gift of gab okay um but it's things that are being talked about behind the scenes that you're not aware of i feel like you're gonna have some kind of um download that comes in for you pretty soon and i don't necessarily feel like this is just me telling you this is some kind of like i guess gossip that's taking place behind the scenes that you don't know i feel like there may be certain people who are conspiring um for you not against you to gift you something okay to bring you something okay i also see somebody over here paying homage to the ancestors taking them flowers for those that are buried i do see some that are also cremated um okay that was really random all right but let me let me look at it 26 okay so we've got 18 let's see 18 17 34 and 35 so Let's break this down, what your gods are coming in and saying. A gift. A gift of a child. Loyalty. Friendship. Abundance. Oh, shit. Stork. Every time I see fish, I get pregnancy, which I have not. I have been doing my best <laughs> to stay away from all of those messages. <sighs> not like it's a bad thing. Some people want kids, but... Um, yeah, there's, there's a message coming in about a child, okay? This is an addition to a family is what I'm seeing with the storks, okay? Let's talk about an addition to the family. I'm also seeing a gift, a closure, um, with the coffin card coming up, what they're trying, okay, and then my right hand started itching, so a good, that's better than my left hand, right? Okay, so y'all about to be getting some finances, some resources, some, uh, resources for a child coming in, for some of you that could definitely be talking. For extended access to this video, click the link below to follow us on to Patreon or go ahead and connect to the membership only. Y'all, I did um, have some bracelets that were sent to me from Otter Spirit. Y'all should definitely go and check them out. Um, they're a small business and each gemstone tells a unique story. So, you know, their authentic gemstones are really cute. I've got like three different bracelets. The turquoise, the lapis lazuli, and the rose quartz from Otter Spirit. Um, anyways, go check them out. That link will also be listed in the description box below. Thanks. Bye.